it's time to go swimming and listen to Carla Darling and stop my juice press today and I'm gonna get fitter and slimmer and healthier and yeah it's gonna be the summer soon the sun is shining and it's time to get up guys I am just about to go into the gym but I have got here a little bit early because my membership is off peak and it doesn't actually start till half past eight and I've jumped out of bed this morning and I'm here by ten past eight I don't really know how that happened but um, I was pretty determined last night to get up and sort my life out so that's what I've done and it's not even open yet so or I can't get in yet well they might let me in a bit early so anyway what I thought I'd just show you is what I'm gonna use today because I've got this nifty little contraption off of eBay think it was probably about six or seven pound with postage or something like that and it's a waterproof holder for well as it was so cheap I'm not tempted I'm not gonna put my iPhone in it just yet because I don't trust it yeah so I'm using my iPod and which I haven't used for a long time and what I've actually got because I thought this might be quite a nice idea is I've downloaded Gala Darlin's Love and Sequins which is her book which you can you can download in a PDF format or you can... What you also get is an MP3 of her gala herself actually reading her book. And you can buy in chapters and each chapter is like 10,000 words at least. And it's just all about kind of learning to love yourself and just having a general positive mental attitude and each chapter is on a specific thing. And what I've done is chosen chapter 1 and 5 because I feel like they're most... Um, oh, my brain isn't functioning this morning. My, oh, I can't think of words. Ugh. Um, most appropriate for my situation and how I think will help me the most. Obviously, if you're going to go and get it, go and choose the one that suits you most. So yeah, so I think the first one's an hour, so I'm going to try and swim for an hour today on the basis that I've got Garlet in my ears, helping me, and um, yeah, I'll let you know how I get on. Hey, just been swimming, look at the state meet. Uh, yeah, a bit hot and sweaty, it's quite, pretty warm and I put a hoodie on and it's probably going to be about 17 degrees today, so yeah, that was a bit crazy. Anyway, I thought I'd share this with you, as you're my friends, and I know you're going to support me. This I've just done in the gym, and so I don't know if you can see that, so weight is 13.8, which is ugh, gross, that's the heaviest I've ever been. Even when I was heavy before, and um, I lost a lot of weight, I was, I was at 13.2 and I went down to 10.2, and that was going back about five years now. And then over the last five years, I put it all back on again. Um, it does say that my body fat is 29% and that is average for my age. Um, but it also says that um, my BMI is 29.9 and that means I am overweight. Um, and whilst actually on this note, I don't actually, I'm not too fussed. Hang on, let's get driving and then I'll tell you. Uh, yeah, I'm not actually that hugely fussed about my weight necessarily but what I am bothered about is the fact that none of my clothes fit me anymore I'm the heaviest or the, the biggest I've ever been I don't feel confident in myself um, I'm not happy uh, you know being naked with Brad not people I think he said people that would be wrong just Brad <laughs> that's the only be that's the only person I'm gonna be naked with anyway but yeah so I just wanted to do something about it do it before it gets too much basically because I know that if I carry on the way I am I'll end up 20 stone and morbidly overweight or something and I just want to feel happier and healthier so I don't want people to watch this and go god I weigh that much and maybe I should lose weight if you're happy if you're happy in yourself then don't worry about it um, and just be happy and you know I'm gonna do this diet and uh, I go through these fads of diets and I'm a serial dieter and it's probably not the best thing in the world and um yeah anyway I'm a, yeah I'm a serial dieter and I'm sorry I'm just boiling in here I can't have the window open otherwise you're not going to hear me Ooh, fans yeah so don't feel bad about yourself if you weigh that much it's my personal choice about the way I feel about my body and yeah I just want to lose a stone get that back down to my happy weight I'm still not going to be skinny because like I'm a size 14 to 16 on my ass now because I'm big on the ass and I 
Yeah, and I just want to get back down to my healthy sort of 12 size, which is probably around a stone and a half lighter. And then, and then, you know, as long as my clothes fit and I'm happy in that respect, then great, I'll be, I'll be happy. So, I don't want you to all watch this and judge your own selves on. I want you to judge yourselves on the way you feel, not on what the scales say, please. Anyway, um, I thought I'd just update you as well on um, Gala Darling because I tried to listen and that waterproof thing really wasn't very good. Well, the waterproof thing, my iPod is dry, so that's check, excellent. But the earphones are pretty shocking. They wouldn't stay in my ear for very long. And therefore, and therefore I couldn't actually hear Gala speaking very well so I ended up just resorting to listening to a bit of Frank Turner which did make me stay in the pool an extra 10 minutes but then I was faffing around with my earphones for probably that amount of time that I spent in there extra um, so I might have to look into getting some better earphones because they are really not good let's make my first juice plus and this is what I'm having so it's juice plus complete vanilla flavour and it's a powder meal replacement and I'm going to blend it uh, I think I'm going to put some oranges in it. What have we got? We've got oranges. Maybe orange and... Orange, because that's all we've got. I'd film my reaction for you. Smells nice. Hmm. Mm, it's quite nice. Mm. So basically the Juice Plus you can mix with lots of different fruit, so it mixes it up every day, So um, and apparently it's got all the vitamins and everything that you would need to not feel kind of lethargic like you would normally on a diet. Mm. So orange and vanilla for breakfast, and then I'm going to have a chocolate one for lunch, and then I'm going to top up on some fruit in the fruit bowl this week so I can have a bit of varied rather than just orange and vanilla every morning, but it's quite nice. Just heading out the door now, and I'm going to see Briar Rose and her lovely partner Grant from Magic Film, 